Hey there. So I said I wasn't gonna do uh, videos <laughs> in my car anymore, but I I needed to come on and chat with y'all for just a minute. I had to work. Uh, well, let me let me start here. We went out to eat last night with my son's friends from school, and we went to a restaurant called Cracker Barrel. So if you guys live in the South, or if you've ever been in the South and you have eaten Cracker Barrel, you know that they have very good southern food now i say southern food not soul food because there is a difference but i digress that's another video um so anyway we ate at cracker barrel and it had been a long time since i've been there great food i usually just get breakfast i don't mess with the other stuff just because i like breakfast food but i prefer my husband's <laughs> breakfast food so i ventured out into some other foods into some other menu items and so um i had some grilled rainbow trout i had some glazed carrots and i had fried okra i love fried okra i also had um some cornbread and i also had a beignet because my husband ordered beignets and i also had a bite of my pancakes because my son's pancakes because their pancakes are just amazing just flat out i love them that's a lot of carbs that's a lot of bread and a lot of stuff that i should not have eaten because i had to work today hence all of this makeup that i have on right now that when i go home i'll wash it off but i had to work today at Lion King and let me just tell y'all a word from the wise is sufficient my mom used to tell me that all the time a word from the wise mine now a word from the wise is sufficient that's what she would tell me so I needed to come on and just encourage you all tonight especially worship leaders praise team singers that's getting ready you have to sing tomorrow for church Sunday morning or whenever time it is that you're watching this video and you have a singing engagement coming up, be mindful of the foods that you eat before you have to sing. Not just right before, but the day before. I woke up this morning and I had a lot of phlegm in my throat. I had a lot of mucus in my throat and my throat was sore. It wasn't sore like sick, but just it just felt, it just didn't feel right. That is because when you eat fried foods or foods that are high in gluten, that type of food may cause an excess of mucus buildup in your body and it can present itself in your throat and in your vocal tract area. So a word from the wise is sufficient. <laughs> Hear me, do not eat fried foods or foods that are high in gluten, lots of bread, um, lots of pasta, things like that, that have the potential of increase, increasing the presence of mucus in your throat because it will take you longer to warm up. You know you're supposed to do vocal warm-ups before you sing, right? So it's gonna take you longer to get in that place of optimum singing that you're used to being in or that you would like to be in when you know you have to perform. So just wanted to share that news, that nugget with you, that uh, vocal athlete note uh, with you so you can take that and let it uh, help you be even more efficient and effective in your in the next time that you are singing or speaking. All right. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys soon. Love you much.